Ni, ni, sama ni. So you guys are starters uh, last year. Who gets wide receiver number one and who gets number two? How do you guys um, sort that out? We don't sort it out. We just line up. We just, we just, we just line up on the field. We don't do like we go to the best wide receiver side because both of us got the same potential to lock down the wide receiver. So we don't really choose sides. So does he go to the far side because he's in better shape, or is that you? Oh <laughs> um, <laughs> 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 Whichever, whichever way the ball plays, and whichever way you just run out the huddle, you know, like I got the side, go this side, so it don't matter. What's your guys' confidence level coming back uh, after starting all, all last year? You guys got a lot of work because of the depth that at cornerback was obviously pretty shallow. Um, our confidence, you know, it did vary from last year to, to now, you know, when we were younger, yeah. as some would say. We had to learn a lot, and now we learned a lot, you know, from our previous season. So coming into this season, we're very confident in ball camp. We've been doing awesome. We did an awesome job so far, and we're trying to continue the consistency. That's been the main thing, main focus in, the, in our DB room is consistency. So we've been handling it up so far. How, how, how much of your confidence comes from mentally learning just how things work, and how much of it comes from physically getting stronger and faster and better? Uh, I feel like... Uh, like the game is so so mental now, so I mean, like you gotta have all the physical parts, but if you don't have it in your mind, then, uh, it's kind of useless. But I mean, we prepare ourselves and we set ourselves to a high standard, uh, watching film together, uh, eating together, just getting to know each other, the chemistry and things like that. And I feel like that builds our confidence. What's the biggest thing you learned mentally last year? Uh, last year, uh, staying the film, staying the film. Cause, uh, what they do on film is what they're gonna do that week. Uh, so basically, that's pretty much it. It all carries over. Is, is Coach Knowles big on that as well? Uh, yes, Coach Knowles is big on that. Uh, I actually, actually like sitting in the film room with him. Uh, he explains everything to you. He breaks it down. He'll get on you, but then he'll tell you why he gets on you. Yeah. Is the scheme change beneficial to you guys just as cornerbacks? What's the biggest change that you guys see? Um, I don't necessarily say it's a big change, but it is kind of different going from playing so much off, playing so much zone, to now when we're in guys' faces, making those guys actually run routes rather than running free releases. Now we're getting those guys' faces being physical. I did think it made a change to our game, and I think it made us better as corners. Are you guys going to get some sacks now? Or? Um, we're not doing too much on the <laughs> pressure. <laughs> yeah, we're standing outside, you know, locking down our one wide receiver, whichever, whichever may it be. Yeah. Who's, the, who's the toughest guy on offense to go against in practice? Um, with our wide receiver core, we have a variety of guys, and you get a different team. You, you get different tendencies from each guy, you know. Like, each guy have their own thing to do, so when you line up against wide receiver, yeah. we watch a lot of film on those guys, so. We just watch what they do and we just play to their style. Who's got the nastiest move, wide receivers? Um, that jukes you out of your socks. Pretty much all the wide receivers got a lot of finesse. <laughs> you know, they got a lot of finesse. You know, most people would say give it to Tyron, but us as corners, we like man, all these guys got some moves they can do. So from the outside looking in, you'll say Tyron yeah. because he got. I say he has the most swag out of those guys. So <laughs> AJ, who's the guy who burns him the most? <laughs> oh. in the guy who burns him the most. Yeah. 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 I just forgot. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, I mean, I don't really know. To be honest, I mean, we it, we get so many reps. It, it, it's a lot of reps. We keep eating, and uh, we actually have some young guys and some uh, guys playing behind us and getting ready. And uh, I just feel like we're trying to prepare them to, to be able to step on that field. Also, what have you seen from Javion and uh, Tanner so far? Tanner. Uh, Javion Tanner and also the uh, the other freshman Gabe Lemon, yeah, yeah uh, they're they're all pretty good. They're they're, they're learning the system. Uh, it's pretty new to them, but uh, I feel like they're uh, ready to buy in and, and they're ready to play. Yeah. How much do you know about the the new guy that committed last last night? Uh, I can't remember his name. From Texas A&M. Yeah, the guy that's from Texas A&M. Do you know anything about him or? No, I heard about it. he took like. 25 hours or so, so, so just by him doing that, you know, he could have easily been like, done with football and stuck it out.